Drinking your tea. Oh, my tea not again. <sighs> Darling, I'm sorry. Mommy couldn't wake up early enough to make your spaghetti. But you promised me. I know. And I said I'm sorry. Hmm? Harry, keep quiet, eat your breakfast, and be grateful. Okay? Babes, what's up now? I'm fine, and you? My dear, I'm fine, no. Only hang over and I remain to come out. Uh -uh. Even on Sunday, Seb, mm -hmm. you still did that way. My dear, take it easy before you go find yourself for God one day. You go understand better. <laughs> My dear, forget that thing. Organize, carry me to come out too. Oh, oh wow. Take a misio. You. you know it's against your profession. Mm. Profession, okay. When I organize the top nine, carry me to the worker. Okay. Mm -hmm. Enjoy my day. No time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah, Stella, what is it now? Yeah. Ah. Stop. Oh, oh, oh Stella! Oh, pen don't make you call me Stella by force. <laughs> no pen, no game. When you walk out go join gym, what do you expect? Hmm? No religion. Babes, okay. wait. This is your eyeliner. You know liner well. I take on side. Wait, wait. <laughs> I see some. This is your eyeliner. Come, mm. wait. What side bed now? Wait, Stella, wait. what is this? You know liner well. This. Ah! Honey. Stella, stop. Oh, wait, wait. What's this? Stop. What happened to you? Honey, who did this to you? Honey. Who did this to you? Stella. I don't know what has come up from Mike. This is not the man I got married to 12 years ago. He went cold and brutal since he lost his job. Mike, your loving and gentle husband did this to you. I, I can't believe this, honey. Yes. Yes, he did. I'm still surprised at his recent attitude. 
came home last night and locked up himself in the guest room for long. I begged him to let me in, but he refused. When he finally came out, he started behaving strange. And, and he hit me. This is unbelievable. I, well, I, I think this is a mistake. Huh? A mistake, you said? He has not talked to me for two days now. Just this morning when I was getting her prepared for school, he hugged and begged my forehead without wanting to talk about it. I just didn't know. Honey, I really don't know what to say anymore. But Mike, your husband used to be loving and caring. What happened to him? Still surprised. Anyway, honey, I'll come to the house so that we'll discuss this further, okay? Huh? But for the meantime, let's cover up this. Let, please, don't cry. Well, to cover up the bruises a bit, okay? Thank you very much, sir. Don't worry, everything will be fine. Just chill. submitted my credentials here two weeks ago and did all the necessary applications. I waited and I haven't heard back from the company like was like you promised and uh, I decided to okay. come and check. Mike was? Mike Dagogo. Okay. Uh, Mike Dagogo. Oh, you must tell there's no such name here. <laughs> I'm, uh, Madam, I'm sure there's a mix-up somewhere. Are you sure? Check again. Check very well. It's it's Mike Dagogo. D-A-G-O-G-O. -G -O. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm very, very qualified for the job. I'm telling you that there's no such name here. Your name is not among the enlisted candidate for the Ma'am, is, is your MD around? No, seriously, is your MD around? I need to see him. Did the company send you any message? Did they call you? No. Then, you are qualifying. Your name is not there. No, but there must be a mix-up somewhere. Okay, is your boss around, please? I need to see him. He said I could call him if there's any problem, and, and, and he assured me that I'll get Oh, God, I'm in charge here. I'm telling you that your name is not there. What is all this? My boss is not around. He traveled yesterday. We'll be back next week. What is all this? And why are you, why are you rude? I told you that your boss said I can I talk to him. I beg your pardon, sir. Stop shouting. This is an office, not a church. Please. Or you want me to call the security? You want to come and call your frustration on me. to drive? Huh? Mike, it's me, Fred. It's me, Fred. Fred, yes, it's me, Fred. Fredo! Yes. Fredo! <laughs> Fredo! Michael! Oh my god, it's been ages. Where are you heading to? Good to see you. Look at you! <laughs> I'm, man, I'm, I'm, I'm having a very long day. I'm going, I'm going home. I'm going home. Where are you coming from? Long story, long story, long story. You know what? You can't go like this. Enter the car, let me take it to my house. I stayed down the estate. You stay close by? Very well. In this estate? Yes. <laughs> Fredo!
This is this is beautiful. You're really living the life I see. <laughs> That's good. That's very good. My brother is just gone on his stronger hearts. That's by the way. So what are you doing around my area? Ha. Hmm. That one is a long story. It's a long story, Fred. Um the Yeah, so um, like I was saying, it's a, it's a very long story, man. You know how we left school and uh, everybody had high hopes, and then I landed that big, that big job with the oil company. You know, uh, yeah, people got retrenched, and I lost it. I, lo I lost my job. Um, I mean, at the beginning, it was it seemed like it wouldn't take this long, but then. I've been jobless for a while now, and uh, I've been submitting my CVs, you know, trying to get a, a job, another job, you know, and um, <laughs> it's not been it's not been good news, to be honest. Uh, even today, I went to one of the offices, you know, the firms where I was sure they were going to take me, you know, the the, the MD there promised me that I was even overqualified for the for the post, but I got disappointed again and. Uh, your boy is frustrated, I swear. It's, it's, it's very okay, frustrating. Okay, calm down. See, life is really unfair. But do not worry about it. You'd always secure another job by God's grace. But I would have asked you to join me on my business. But I don't, I already know you. I do not think you can do the kind of my job. But. Nah, no. Hell no. Come on, man. You know me, you know, you've presented this thing to me several times. No, there's no way I'm doing this. There's no way I'm getting into your kind of business. It's, it's not possible. I couldn't do it then. I can't do it now. More so because I even, I even have a family now. I mean, I'm married and I have a son, so it, it's a no-go for me, man. I can't. <sighs> My dear, I, I really get frustrated most times, you know. This whole thing is eating me up. It's... It's turning me into someone that I can't even recognize, you know, I... <laughs> can you... Can you believe that... I hate my wife? What? I hate my wife, man. It's... It's, it's embarrassing. It's terrible. It's... It's okay. Calm down. Just be yourself. Everything will be alright. Yeah? Just serve yourself. I'll be right back. Let me get this up. I think it is. 
No, man. You know, I can't. I don't do this anymore, uh, man. Ah, uh, you're my. No, that's. Sit, sit, cup, sit, sit, sit. I've thrown away that habit. Wait, I go, don't. Go, go. No more. Please. Never. Mike. No. Mike, wait, wait, wait. You must collect this from me. Come on. It's your favorite. Just go. Stop. See, I will send you some money in your account. Just take it. Hmm? Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, man. Mike, go. Take, take. You know what? Uh, don't worry. Just take it. You're my man. I don't do no. this anymore. You know what this does to me, man. My days of Seriously. Like, no. Yes, it's my favorite, but it's. With this. What will become of me and your son? Your son, Mike! Listen, honey. Honey. I'm sorry about this, okay? Just. Just forget about what you saw. Forget it. Okay? I promise you, it will. It will never happen again. I promise. Please. Mike. You need help. Why not let me in? Let's tackle this together. That's why we're family. I'm fine, okay? I said I'm fine. Mike, you're not! Everything is wrong with you! You're going mad! What? Don't you ever, Mike, ever Mike, talk to me again! Mike, you hear me? Yeah. Mike. What's wrong? Huh? He's doing drugs. Who's doing drugs? Mike, he's doing drugs. You're joking, right? Jesus is my father. Why is he on drugs? I saw him. I walked into him in our bedroom. Oh my God, Ami, it's okay. Everything will be fine, okay? Nothing will be fine. Stella, as you can see, everything around me is going down. My marriage is going down. My husband is coming with the tragedy of losing his job. So has my joy. I'm not happy. <laughs> Annie, you are. Annie, you are fine. You still have Harry, remember? Yeah. Harry. He walked into myself and his father screaming at each other. Annie, you need to take it easy. Everything will eventually work out fine. Hmm? When? When is that going to be? 
I don't know. I don't know, but we can figure out how to work out things together as friends, yeah? Okay? God has abandoned me. Don't say this, Annie. If he has given my husband another job, he wouldn't have gone into this. Please stop blaming God. Don't say this. You know what? Annie. Cheer up. Tomorrow I'm, go I'm going to take you out, okay? You need some fresh air. I think we need to go out. Cheer up. Tomorrow I will. I'll do that, okay? Please, it's okay. Stop crying. What can I do without you? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> You're just too much. I'm sorry for making you feel. <laughs> I'm so so tasty. Mm -hmm. Thank you very, very, very much for bringing me out. I appreciate it. Don't mention any, anything for you. Mm -hmm. Me. Good evening. I can see you're having fun after the day's stress. <laughs> Are you too, sir? Of course. Because as a bachelor, this has become my humble kitchen. Considering the stress we go through in the office. <laughs> well, enjoy yourself, you know, do have fun and have a good night. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Bye, good sir. night. So this is where you come for us. Should if you fly, should lean on me. Should if you fly. Make all the things that my eyes don't see. Killed the love, so I guess I'm a murderer. Try to find it hard, seeing things in your picture. Got things mixed up, let's fix things up. Shall I know I'm making a cry, but I can make a break. Come on, you go. I want to see the pastor. Okay, is it okay you're coming? No. Okay, let's see them. Hello, sir. This is Annie who's here to see you. Okay, sir. Okay. Please, sir. Um, can you... Okay. Oh, okay. Um, Thursday, 4 p.m., right? All right. Definitely. Definitely, I'll be there, man of God. All right. Thank you very much. All right. Daughter of Zion, how are you and the family? Oh, thank God. Mm -hmm. I'm not okay. Husband. My husband. My husband has not been himself since he lost his job. I'm not doing well at all. My dear, I understand exactly what you're going through. But I don't want you to lose hope. I want you to go back to God in prayers. Tell him your pains. Pour out your heart to him. I know he will hear you. The Bible says you should be anxious for nothing, but by prayer, with supplication and thanksgiving, we should make our request known to God. God will definitely see it. And meanwhile, let me pray with you. I know you want my love. Heavenly Father, thank you for I'll not let you go. I'll not let you go. This is love. This is love. This is love. Get you 
office. As soon as you're through, just get into the office for me. Don't relax. Like she's going. She's going. Come on, come on, come on. Don't worry. 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 Don't Mother, please calm down. Okay? Please calm down. She's gonna be okay. Um, it's just that uh, we need to perform a very serious surgery on her and we need a specialist to do that. We've arranged for all that. She's gonna be okay. Will that save her? We believe so. Please, if we... that is what we save her, please, doctor, do it. Madam, we please believe so. Just calm down. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Thank you, doctor. All, all right, yeah. saw you anymore. You didn't even tell me. No, 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 no. Nothing like that. I, I just had to leave. Of course, it's been done late now, you know, and um I, I got I got a call. Uh, I was told I had something very important to attend to in the hospital. Nice. I see how busy you are these days. That's what we pray for now. Bros, not be sad they're too busy for you now. How about I can Oh yes, yes. Yeah, I, I forgot to let you know. Um you need to attend to a very important case um, uh, here, here for me in the hospital this morning, yes. Well, it, it's, it's fine. Just um, refer them to my hospital. I'll, I'll handle it. Uh, no, I could have referred to you, you know. I, I usually do, you know, but this patient is very, very critical. The condition is quite critical. I can't even move the patient. You just need to be here. So here is the fact. Yeah, yeah, yes. Um, Okay, uh, what time is it? 9 a.m. 9. Oh, it's fine. Uh, I'll just freshen up. I'll be there in uh, another hour. Say by, by 8. Okay, then. 9 a.m. Yes, yes, 9 a.m. All right, my brother. Thank you. I'll be expecting you. Thank you. Here's the file, Astro. Yeah, um... Please, keep it on my table, right? Okay. Yeah. Stella. You look so beautiful today. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Babes. Yeah? I'm no longer comfortable in this office. What are you talking about? I don't like the way he looks at me. You still haven't passed any message. Oh God, now. I be done, Dave. <laughs> okay. So, what about him? The way he stares at me these days. He no drive me one day for your office, so. Haba. <laughs> Why are you talking like this? Oh, okay, yes. He may be interested in you, but not to that level. Uh-uh, think positive now. She's a gentleman. Oh, oh, gentle a bit. Mm-hmm, okay. Oh. God should continue to help him to be gentle. <laughs> Stella, believe me to walk a bit. <laughs> mm. Oh, no, so... The report. Okay, let me see it. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? Okay. Not to worry, the pains will subside any time from now. The drugs we gave you would um, help relieve the pain. Just take them as prescribed, okay? Thank you. All right, then. Uh... 
Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. All right, there we go. So I would um, always call to check up on your progress, okay. um, but the nurses here and doctors will take good care of you in good hands. All right. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> take care. Yes, Have you given the patient any word to his medication? Yes, ma. The medication we are giving exactly as prescribed. All right. Take this to Dr. Ken to sign. I will sign it for you. Okay, ma. to applaud you for bringing your best in surgery today. You practically saved that man's life. Ah, no, sir. You did the job. I only aided you. So we should be thanking you for a good job well done. You know, you're only good at what you do, I must say. I'll take that as a compliment. You're welcome. Um, but you are you really beautiful, my mother, I must confess. I, I, so I walked into that surgery room and I saw this gorgeous lady and decided to bring my A game, the Dr. Newton swag. Mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> I see. I can see that. I, I guess I, I came rather late. Too yes, late. So. <laughs> you came late. <laughs> But hope you don't mind we we be friends. Hey, 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 don't give me that look. That's just friends. Friends to say. Yeah. Okay. Nice to meet you. you Same know. here, Annie. You too. I can I at least get we're friends now, right? <laughs> can I at least yeah. get your number? Okay. Thank you. All right. Doctor, yeah. you sent for me. Stella, how are you? I'm fine. Um, please come with me. So you still haven't told me why you asked me to follow you here. Kelvin. Call me Kelvin, my dear. OK. OK, sir. I said Kelvin. Oh, okay, Kelvin. Better. But that's not the answer. <laughs> the other day you asked me to go to the club with you. And today you brought me here. I mean, for over 30 minutes now, you haven't said anything. Okay, okay, okay. Tell me, where is it written that um, the boss cannot hang out with his staff? You see, my dear, we worked together for quite some time and I must be frank with you, I have taken time to observe the kind of person you are. And I must commend you. You're a very diligent person. You take your work seriously. Um, I think you're the kind of woman that a, a man would like to have as a, a partner, if you ask me. Oh, okay, thank you, sir. Kelvin. Oh, oh. Okay, Kevin, All right. I've heard you and I think I will think about it. Um, I don't know what you want to think about, but let me tell you. Let me tell you straight from my mind. Stella, the time comes in every man's life when he must take a very fundamental decision. Observing you through these years, I think you would make one of the best wives any man can have. And I don't think I should stay there and wait until some smart ass guy comes to just whisk you away when I have the opportunity of uh, having you all to myself. Okay, I've heard you. So. All right, 
Can we go back to the hospital now? Um, okay, fine. I am grateful for your time. Uh, why don't we just uh, do this together? Should if you fly, should you lean on me? Should if you fly? Like all the things that my eyes don't see. I'm so sorry. Work was so hectic today. Hope you're okay. Yes, please. All right. Sorry. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much for looking out for me. There's no problem, ma. He was the only primary school pupil remaining. So oh. I decided to stay back and take care of him. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Let me get this back. Oh, okay. Thank you. Baby, I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry. I'll try to get you something to eat before we get home, okay? Thank you. Harry. Yeah. Oh, please. Take this for back. Thank you very much. To knock yourself out. You've taken two bottles of red and now you've gone to an Andre. What is wrong with you for God's sake, Mike? My son knows. My son knows that I fight with his mother. He knows I'm eating his mother. Mike. What went wrong this time? Eh? We had a, a little argument, a little fight. Just that? Yes. Yes, but the thing is, every time, every time I step into my house, I just, I feel like a failure. I feel like I've let them down. I feel like I've failed them. See, I don't know how to describe it. See, Mike, you have to pull yourself together and take charge of this situation. Don't let this eat you up, for God's sake. I don't know what to think anymore. Maybe she's right. I'm frustrated. I failed. I guess she's right. See, Mike. You have to take things easy. I think you should be going back home now because your wife and your son should be worried about you. Please. Should if you fly, should you lean on me? Should if you fly? Make all the things that my eyes don't see. Hey, baby boy. 
Morning, son. How was the night? Fine, thank you. Good. Harry, you're not eating your food. What is the problem? Um, there's no problem. Why not? Joe, don't feel like eating. Honey, um, you are my hero baby boy, right? So beyond, so beyond. And we lose a set. Yeah, that means she's right? yeah. It's right? Yeah. It's your boy, I'm clean. Uh, yeah. Truly, you emotional. I think I killed the love, so I guess I'm a mother. Mm. Try to find it hard to see things in your picture. Got things mixed up, let's fix things up. Shall I know I make you dry, but I can make it rain. I'm taking all your pains, taking all the blinks, case close up. Shall the few flower, the key, let's roll up. Take a little wine to the thing, let's go to stuff. Shall it might have needed, I do appreciate it. That every single face I fed it, I don't relate it. I find it difficult to talk to her for a minute. Right through her eyes, all I see is pains and emotions. Shut the few flash, shut the lean on me Let go of the things that my eyes don't see Cause I'm just a man and I'm not perfect Don't call me suicide, suicide You again. Good afternoon, sir. <laughs> good afternoon. Good, good to see you again. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, you, you, you live around here? Um, yes. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> so how are you, sir? How is family? I'm fine. And family? None. I'm not married. Okay, good for you. Um, Annie, it's good I'm seeing you now. Uh, I'd like to ask a favor. I'm pleased you don't say no. Uh, what would that be for me to ask? I'd like you to say yes first, before I spill. I know, I can be weird like that. Okay, no problem. Um, um I, I don't know what your schedule is like, but um, I'd like to buy you dinner. Depending on when it's comfortable with you. Today, tomorrow? Is that all? That's it. <laughs> and then I have something really important I'd like to share. Oh, really? Okay. Okay. I'm making you feel the way that you've been feeling, baby. Love to overdose, love to overdose. Please let's take it slow, please let's take it slow I know you weren't my love, I know you weren't my love Thank you so much for for coming. I really do appreciate. You're welcome. And thanks for the meal. No, it's nothing. We didn't get um, the chance to talk at length the other time and get to know ourselves better. Create this avenue. Okay. So, tell me about yourself. Um, where are you from? Okay. I'm from River State. The whole world to be precise. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Thank you. What about you? I'm from Cross River. Yeah, I grew up there, but I lived almost all my life in, oh, in Cross River. That's nice. 
So, um, family, any siblings? Really sad. Is that why I'm here? You know I don't have much time left. You said you have something very important to share with me. I'm all ears, please. I must confess, I, uh, I haven't been able to get you up off my head since the day I met you. I don't intend to disrespect your marriage, but um, I really meant what I said about us being friends. It's a new thing. You can't end friendship by inviting people out for lunch. Besides, I told you I'm happily married. I can't be seen walking around with you. Uh, no disrespect to your marriage, but I'm just asking for friendship, that's all. Nothing more. You know, sometimes I to be friends with you. I, I see you as a very responsible and reasonable woman. And I just need a friend I can always talk to. Talk to your mother. Talk to a friend. Talk to your wife. I lost my parents when I was um, a child. And my wife, she died in a boat's mishap last year. And the only person I consider a friend is too busy for me, your boss. Sorry, I I don't mean to resurrect bad memories. I mean, it's fine. It's uh, it's it's okay. I I have gotten over them, so uh, it's fine. Seeing you at the hospital that day, he did something to me. Just brought some sort of glow to me. Forgotten that married with a child. All I'm asking for is just be there for me. just for the night. Tomorrow is going to be a brighter day. Like the wind that blows in my morning. All I see is a new horizon. Who was that? A friend. A friend. A friend I do not know. Yes. Can I see your phone? Don't tell me you hold no single respect for me anymore. I go out there every day, fighting so hard to keep this family running, despite the pains that I get. I fight every day to make sure we're okay, both financially and otherwise. Yet, you hold no single respect for me. Is this how cheap you now look at me? Or is it because you're jobless? Excuse me, please.
Hello, Stella. This one, you're coming so late. I hope everyone is okay. No, 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 no. Oh, Annie. You went too far. Mission is joblessness. And where is he now? He's downstairs. Oh. You have to apologize to him. You went too far. I know. I, I feel so terrible right now. But what do you expect from me? His attitude got to my nerves. No matter what. He shouldn't have rubbed his joblessness on his face. No man would take that. I know. I don't even know how to face him right now. You have to. And do it this night. You have to apologize, huh? And do it this night. Yeah. Okay. I'll speak with you tomorrow. Thank you very much. perfectly. It's good. At least now I know your thoughts about my present situation. Baby, please. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to dis disrespect you in any way. Please forgive me. Please. Annie, give me a loan, please. I want to sleep. We'll talk about this tomorrow. version of my case video. Another version of him? What do you mean by that? You know, after talking to you, mm. he came in immediately. I went to his own side of the bed to sleep. I tried to apologize like you said. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> he never had my time. All I said was not his concern at all. You mean he did not even raise his voice at you? Okay. I'm scared now because I don't know his next action. Stella, please sign this document so I can take it to you. You don't talk. last month. And don't tell me you're having a thing with it. Even you too. You don't trust me. I'll, I'll be the is actually asking me out. I'll be the last person to advise you into this act of violence. Huh. I didn't tell you uh, we're going out. I just like him as a friend. I think it's a nice person. 
Annie. Annie. How many times did I call you? Twice. Face the problem you have at hand. Stella, me, I don't have any problem. Maybe you should call my and tell him that. Do not say I did not warn you. <laughs> for the night. Tomorrow is going to be a brighter day. Like the wind in my morning. For now, I have once felt the Asian horizon. Mommy massage her leg. I'm feeling sharp pain. Ah! Oh. Mm. Yeah. Why do you like wear makeup often? I guess I like looking good sometimes. Why? Don't you like it? I like it, but you look like Dracula. Which one is Dracula again? She's from Monster High. Monster High? That's high school monsters, right? Yeah. What's the story about monsters again? She's 1,600 years old. Hmm. That sounds interesting, right? Yeah. Hey. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Good? You're welcome. Yeah. Ah, so, ooh. tell me. What do you have for daddy tonight? I was telling mommy about Dracula from Monster High. You were telling mommy? Go, job. Ah! Nonsense. Come. I hope you're not hot. My hand. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. Ouch. Okay, don't worry. I'm using massages in the morning, okay? Okay, mom. Alright. I'm sorry. Get worse, get worse, get worse when we don't understand. <laughs> Yeah. 
Mom, mm -hmm. I like being by you. Oh, I like being by you too. Hmm? evening i'm fine and you i'm okay how are your husband and your kid he's in the room harry is asleep already <laughs> lucky you you have a booming family you have a husband and a kid to go back to every day unlike some of us i just come home to an empty house you're right when you said i'm lucky so uh tell me <laughs> What does your your husband do? Uh, um, it's okay. It's okay if you if you don't feel the need to answer that. I'm even sorry for asking. No, 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 not at all. After all, you told me about your past and everything about you. It's just that it's just that everything is complicated right now. Yeah, I understand. Don't worry. Okay, enough about me. How was your day? I had a good day. I had a good day. Um, two emergencies, um, three new bonds, and um, lots of consulting. Wow. Hope you had time to rest. Yeah, pretty much. I just got back, actually. And um, I felt the need to call someone, and that's why I'm calling you. I hope I'm not disturbing you, though. Oh, no, not at all. Oh, thank goodness. I was hoping I, I called at the right time. If you understand what I mean. Um, uh, let me call you at the office tomorrow. I need to rest now, okay? And be careful with those drugs. <clears throat> you've been on the you've been on the phone for a pretty long time. You were on the phone when I left, and you still are. I, I didn't I didn't realize it took that long. You didn't realize it took that long. Wow. So who was that? Who? Oh, you mean the person on the phone? Just a patient from the office. And what did this patient from the office want? Nothing serious. Just, um, just, uh, you know, wanted a clear direction on how to take his medication. Interesting. I'm of the opinion that you leave office work at the office, not bringing it back home. Okay. I'm sorry. I, I couldn't just ignore him. Well, you could have told him that you will call him back tomorrow. Or you see him tomorrow. Is that work, right? I know I make you dry, but I can make it rain. I take in all your pains, take in all the blanks, case close up. Shut the few flower with the king, let's roll up. Take a little wine to the sink, let's go stuff. Shut it might have needed, I depreciated. That every single pain's I faded, I done related. I find it difficult to talk to her for a minute. Right through her eyes, all I see is pains and emotion. Shut the few flowers, shut the lean on me. Let go of the things that my eyes don't see. 
Cause I'm just a man and I'm not perfect Don't call me suicide, suicide This is love, this is love What a pleasant surprise. It's so good to see you again. <laughs> you know, I, I watch here sometimes when, um, I, when I have the chance. Oh, really? So why haven't I seen you here before? Or are you following me? Come on, how can you even think that? <laughs> I think I'm ready to leave. Um, okay. So who's your, who's your friend? Oh, babe, um, this is um, Dr. Nyotin, um, Dr. Digi's friend. The specialist that came once, that once came to the hospital. Yeah, I must say your wife is a very admirable woman. So hardworking. She's one of the best nurses that hospital has. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, um, I came for second service. I, I have to run now. All right, let's take yeah. care. You seemed awfully uncomfortable seeing that man. Oh. Really? Um, I'm not just comfortable the way you looked at me. Really? something, not that much. Oh, thanks a ton. So, nice work. One well, case being quite hectic. I, I literally had to escape from there to come and see you as promised. You didn't promise me anything new thing. Sweetheart, you forget so soon. Yesterday, when I was with your family, I said I was gonna see you later, soon. This is later, this is soon, voila. <laughs> but that was just a cover up and you know it. And I'm not your sweetheart, please. You just turned red when I called you sweetheart. See you blushing again. You like it, just admit it. Just admit I'm it. not blushing. <laughs> uh, Annie, I don't mean to pry, but... Um, is, um, is something wrong between you and your husband? Something like what? I couldn't help but notice the tension between both of you. I don't know what you're talking about. But you must know that I love my husband, Kelly, and my husband loves me too. Why then did you lie to him yesterday? Why weren't you bold enough to tell him that I'm your friend? Why were you quick to dismiss me the day he came into the room? Why did you refuse that I come to lunch with your family? Because I don't want him to get suspicious. My husband lost his job and he has been going through a lot. I don't want to add to his worries, all right? Is that all, Annie? Listen. You can talk to me about anything. I don't want to talk about anything with you. Please just go. Newton, please go. 
All right, I'm sorry if I, if I made you feel some sort of way. Oh, I mean. Hey, girlfriend. What's going on? I heard your voice from my office. And you didn't tell me Newton came. And why are you crying? I'm not crying. You're not crying. And you have tears in your eyes. I, I don't know. I, I met him in church yesterday. And he said he would see me in the office. He noticed the strain in my relationship with Mike. And he wants me to admit that there's something wrong with my marriage. How insensitive of him. Is it not true? Do you know the last time I sat down and talked with Mike without shouting and staring at each other? Do you know the last time he looked at me like a woman? When was the last time he told me how beautiful I am? Girlfriend, you're hurting yourself the more. Eh? Mike is going through things right now. And you said it yourself. Everything will eventually turn out fine. Huh? Okay? Please, stop crying. Okay? Let's do this. Okay? I can't remember the last time he came to say good night. I know. Listen. I just want you to know that everything will be all right. I also want you to forget, you know, everything you think you've seen or hearing now that is bothering you. You know you're a man now, right? Good, good, and I know one day you'll grow up to become a better father than I am. I'm sure of it. Yes, Dad. Dad, but you and Mommy have been shouting at each other, and you told me that fighting is not good. You need to understand that once in a while, adults need to argue to resolve issues, and um, that's exactly what your mother and I are doing. Okay, we're just having little arguments, but everything will be fine. All right, Dad. I promise you. Yes. That's my boy. All right. Get some sleep, okay? Deny. I can yeah, see it. I'm not. It's, just, it's just that. You're beginning to develop feelings for Newton, right? I'm no, I'm not. It's just that it reminds me of what Mike used to be before he changed. You know, loving, caring, gentle. Oh, Stella, I don't know. I just don't know. Girl, no matter how you deny it, you're developing feelings for this guy, and you need to be careful. Oh, Stella, please, don't blame me if this is true. Just look at me. Mike is making me go crazy. We're living together, but not married. And you think falling for Newton will bring your home back? I am not falling for Newton. He said he loves me. Who? Newton. 
and, and, and you still want to keep him, you still want to keep him as a friend? Now, let's face it, Annie. Which married woman keeps an admirer to the detriment of her family? Hmm? Stella, there is no more family here. Mike destroyed our family the day he started hitting me and doing drugs. I can't even remember the last time he held me. Annie, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't get this. I mean, I don't get you. Can't you find a way to straighten out things with Mike, just for the sake of Harry? Huh? Stella, I understand what you're talking about. I, I still love Mike. Oh, he's frustrating me. OK, don't worry. I promise I won't do anything bad. OK, but do not say I did not warn you. Birthday, and um, I couldn't think of anyone else to celebrate it with other than you. Um, I'm glad you're here. I just want to be here sharing this special moment with you. Happy birthday, Newton. Thank you. I really need to go now. Go? Why? I mean, you, you just got here. Please, dance with me. I'm, I'm not a good dancer. And besides, there's no music. Do not worry. Let us dance to the music in our hearts, Annie. Mm -hmm. That's it. So from side to side, back to relax. <laughs> so much fun. And relax, relax. It's just the both of us here. There's no one else here. Just feel the moment. Um, come on. What is it? Why? Why, why are you crying? Did, did I hurt you? Did I do anything? No. You didn't hurt me. Just that. Just that. It's been long. I felt this way. I'm not supposed to feel like this for another man. Come on, come on. Oh, I just don't understand. I, I understand. I understand that. This thing. It's not a bad feeling. Yeah. All you feel is love. Just, just bask in the moment. Okay? Annie. I need to go. Wait, please. Please. Please stay with me. Stay with me. All right. I just want... I just want you to be here with me. Let's take it slow, please. Let's take it slow. I know you weren't my love. I know you weren't my love. I'll not let you go. I'll not let you go. This is love. This is love. I gotta say that I love. This is love. This is love. I don't want to live the same old life. This is love. This is love. I got the feeling that I'm lost This is love, this is love I don't wanna live this way no more
<clears throat> you know, I waited up for you last night. I realized you returned home at a very, very ungodly hour. I wonder why any good, reasonable wife would come back home at that time. Maybe if a reasonable husband had been good to his now bad wife, she wouldn't have stayed out late. As usual, every sinner always finds a good reason to defend himself. What's your problem, Mike? What's wrong with you? You now act like you no longer exist. You've forgotten about me. You have forgotten about Harry. You have forgotten about everything about your home. What's your problem? What's wrong with you? You are the one who has forgotten everything about yourself. Just think you should look at yourself. I see how miserable you have become. Shut if you fly Make all the things that my eyes don't see Cause I'm just a man and I'm not prepared Don't call me suicide, don't call me suicide yeah. Hey, hope you do have fun in school today What? You're going to play with your friends, right? Yeah Okay Now get out of my car <laughs> Bye, mom. Bye, love. Hey, I love you, boy. Take care. Bye. Uh. Killed the love, so I guess I'm a mother. Try to find it hard, seeing things in your picture. Got things mixed up. Yeah, thank you so much. Sorry, I couldn't come again. Thank you very much. is gone. Gone where? She's gone. She's... She's left her son. 
When is she going to come back? You don't get it, do you? Your mother is gone. She has left us. She has left you. She has left me. We're all by ourselves now. What did you do? What? I didn't do anything, okay? Boy, I didn't do anything. Your mother has given up on us. No, she can't. Harry. I won't let you out. Harry. Harry, stop. Harry. Boy. No, she can't. I won't let you out. Harry. Boy. Hey, I'm serious. Listen, I didn't do anything to her. You need to behave yourself, Harry. Harry, stop it. Harry. Mike is dead. Or he's aware of what really happened. It's just you and I. And he's safe. Stella, you won't understand how I feel right now. Even though I have started to go home. I can't even face him with this great secret. I have wronged him and Harry. It's okay. Everything will be fine. You think so? I know so. Stella, I did not leave the house because I had a fight with Mike. I, I can't even face him. I, I, oh, God. I had to struggle to drop Harry off. Stop crying. Stop crying. Hmm? It's okay. Stop you. I've been calling for for a few minutes now, but it seems you're lost in your thoughts. Never mind. Okay, ma'am. The doctor said I should give you this file. Thank you. But ma, I strongly believe there's something disturbing you. But don't tell me because I know I can't help you. But tell your good. I believe it can help you. Fly. Make all the things that my eyes don't see. Cause 
How are you doing? As you can see, I'm doing great. I just want to thank you for everything. It was nice being friends. I, I don't want you around me anymore. Annie. Look, the, the reason I'm always around you is that uh, I cherish this, this thing we share. And I don't want to lose it. That is exactly what I want to cut off from. I, I do want us to continue seeing each other. What are you talking about? What I'm saying is... I want to work on my home. I want my marriage back. But I can't have it with you beside me. Is, is, is that a joke? How can you even be saying that to me? You want to go back to that jerk? All he has done is make your life miserable. That man has no iota of love for you and you know it. That jerk, like you call him, is still my husband. The father of my only child. He may be the worst man now, but I'm ready to try the second time. So, what, what happens to me now? What we share, what happens to us? There's no us, nothing. There's no us. As you can see, it is not working. We're not meant to be together. Whatever that happened was a mistake. So, that's it. This is how you want to say goodbye. I have to leave now. Love to overdose, love to overdose. Please let's take it slow, please let's take it slow. I know you weren't my love, I know you weren't my love. I'll let you go. Stella, um, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm, I'm doing good. I was just um, coming to check on um, Annie. Any idea where she is? Is she around? Oh, Annie is sick, so she went home. Oh, 
But what's wrong with her? I think fever, but she'll be okay. Just um, send my regards to her and um, tell her that I've been trying to, um, I've been calling her, that she should um, take my call at least. Okay, sir. I will. All right. I've got um, the surgery in the evening, sir. Okay. Okay. Good morning. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Mm. Daddy, daddy. What? Oh, good morning. Good morning. Whoa. You're ready for school. I'm late for school. You, wow, okay. Sorry. What What time is it? I'm running late. Even at the Choma, she's downstairs. Choma is here already? Yes. Okay, that means you're very late. Uh, the good thing is you're set, you're dressed. I'm impressed. Look at you. All right, uh, let Daddy change into some clothes, okay? Okay, I'm coming down. I'm coming down. Wow. Oh, God. Shut if you fly, should lean on me. Shut if you fly. Make all the things that my eyes don't see. Cause I'm just a man and I'm not prepared. Hey, son, what would you like to eat? Spag and egg. Spag and egg for lunch? Yeah. Alright, let me hurry up and get your lunch quickly. Alright, so you don't want to take the school? Buy yourself something, okay? Thank you, For sir. For lunch, yeah. Thank you. We'll get you to school. Happy? Uh, mommy ever taught you how to slice? Please? No. No? <laughs> Anyways, it's dangerous because the knife is what? Very sharp. Very sharp. But it's, it's easy anyway. Just slide along here. Don't get too close to your finger. Well, you have to be careful to slide. Just beside your fingers, like this. See? This is proven stubborn. And um, this one's a um, this one's a gate. Let me get the gate. Help me wash out this few dishes, okay? I'll be right back. Yeah, good day. How may I help you? Hey, sorry, is this the resident of Mr. Mike Dalagogo? Yes. What can I do for you? Okay, I have something for you. Sign off? Yes, you have to. So you have me at some point to sign off. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah.
Aha! That's my boy. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. Don't worry, then you finish it up. Okay? Hmm. You know, it's funny, I didn't even ask you. What exactly would you like to eat? Rice. Hmm? Rice. <laughs> rice. You like rice too much. Right? Didn't you have rice yesterday? You want rice again today? What kind of rice? Fried rice. Fried rice. Fr fried rice. That who will make? You. <laughs> No, you're trying to set me up. <laughs> oh. My. God. Da, what is it? Harry! Harry, I got my job back! I got my job back! Come here, I got my job back! I got my job back! Daddy got his job back! I got my job back! Oh my god, this is the best news I've had in ages. Mm. So, today you are early. Alright, son. Dad, Make when is mommy going to come back? Mom is going to come back very soon. Okay? Okay, Daddy. Now smile for me. That's my boy. Make sure I have a good day at school, too. Good day at school. Yeah. Promise? Yeah. Promise. Cheers. All right, I'll pick you up after after school. Yeah. Don't forget your lunch bag. I will admit that I haven't been the, what you would call the best husband or father. I have, I failed. <laughs> I failed. I don't even, I don't know how to face up to her now. Bro, Mike, God has a reason for everything. Um, I wanted to cheer up. Probably go check for her in one of her friend's places. And I know she has weird things. So probably she might be in one of their houses. Hmm? You don't need to allow yourself to be bothered. When you go check on her and you don't find her, then you can come back. We'll take it from there. Hmm? Cheryl. Thank you. Yes, well. Thank you for everything. Yes, Thank well. you very much. Yes, I, will, well. I will let you know how, how things pan out. Thank you. It's good. It's good. It's good.
Shut if you fly Make off the things that my eyes don't see Cause I'm just a man and I'm not prepared Don't call me suicide, don't call me suicide I did. I knocked, I knocked, I knocked. I even called her phone several times. She didn't respond. That was before I tried calling you. Okay. No problem. I'm sure I'm sure it's done. Okay. Alright. <laughs> My wife is funny. Do you think that I got this for her as a this scarf for her as a reconciliation gift? Really? Wow. I need you. I'm so you. Harry. 
issue. Have an issue, honey. Okay? <laughs> Should it feel fly, should it lean on me? Should it feel fly? Make off the things that my eyes don't see. Cause I'm just a man and I'm not prepared. Don't call me suicide, don't call me suicide, yeah. This is love, this is love. I got the feeling that I ain't lost. This is love, this is love. I don't want all of this way to this is love, I got the feelings that I love. This is love, this is love. I killed the love, so I guess I'm a murderer. Try to find it hard.